Hey guys, this is Azerlin with a quick review of Through the Woods. Through the Woods is a spooky, atmospheric walking simulator where you play as a mother searching for your missing son. The story is compelling and I was immediately captivated by the premise. I don't want to spoil anything, but as the story progressed, it made some interesting turns. Once I learned about the main character's backstory, I didn't like it and she became completely unrelatable and resulted in me not appreciating the narrative anywhere near as much as I did in the beginning. There isn't much to say about the gameplay, as it's essentially a walking simulator. The added spookiness of the game is a nice touch, but this game is by no means a horror as described. The occasional deadly creatures that you have to bypass are interesting, but there aren't that many of them. There are a couple enemies that chase you, and it reminded me of Alan Wake, where you need to use your flashlight to fend them off. I would have liked more encounters similar to that. The environments are great, and nature looks absolutely beautiful. The character designs are alright, but they don't look anywhere near as nice as the environments do. There are also some issues I noticed with textures popping, as well as significant frame drops. The game's graphical options are severely limited, and to play the game smoothly, you'll need to meet some hefty system requirements. The music and sound effects are excellent. I especially like the more creepy parts of the game, where the ominous music and immersive environments had me feeling apprehensive about my surroundings. The voice acting could have been better. The mother's dialogue sometimes lacked emotion. The game took me a little over two hours to complete, and there's not really any reason to replay it. There are collectibles and lore stories to find on your journey, but I didn't really want to explore. Mainly because the way the story is told, you feel a sense of urgency to find your missing son. So it's unnatural and uncharacteristic of a mother to want to stop and read stories while her son's life could be in danger. The game is extremely short for the price and I expect that many people will experience performance issues since the system requirements are pretty high. Generally, I enjoy walking simulators, and I did like the eerie, atmospheric feel of this game. The story was certainly intriguing, and I really liked the overall premise of it, but didn't wind up liking it as much as I thought I would. If this is a game you're interested in, I suggest waiting for a significantly discounted price. I hope this review has helped you. If you enjoyed it, please like, subscribe, and post your feedback in the comments below. Thanks everyone, and have a wonderful day!